What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Uh, today you can see we're not starting in the garage, but uh, we did get into a little bit of trouble. We're out back here uh, at Ryan's warehouse. He has a couple acres here that we do. He has some off-roading. There's a mud pit back over here. Uh, we just climbed this. Now it's Ben's turn to get up on here. This whole property is 120 acres. 120 acres? Yeah. No problem. Now backwards. Yeah. <laughs> Fourth gear, just launch it. Yeah, send it. Easy peasy. Here's a stock height two door. Ben and I needed the lifts to get past this section here because it's pretty steep. See a few bottoms out. Oh, oh you got it. Hell yeah. <laughs> yeah, you guys hit less than I did. This is doesn't look like much, but it's probably. Oh shoot. That's like eight foot. Eight foot's like pretty much straight up. Yeah, I scraped a little bit, a tiny bit. On this cross member here is a piece of grass. Other than that, we're doing pretty good. I'm proud of this stubby. Yeah, I know. That's, everybody that sees it in person is like, it actually looks a lot better than I thought it was gonna look. Thanks, Ben. Okay. Damn, Ben, you're ruining the vibe. All green Jeeps, bro. So, <laughs> so your, your left stick is rotate the bird okay. and your up and down height your vertical height so that's down okay. and then you can see here your height you're at 25 feet and then this is your forwards reverse left and right it's so weird because i'm watching it here but yeah. i could hear it yeah right no here. watch up there and fly and watch the controls oh, i don't know about that that's okay you see where the camera is pointing okay <laughs> Oh, so it just lost GPS. <laughs> okay. No, you're fine. Not running towards it doesn't do anything. <laughs> Run close. It just, for it some reason. I thought it lost signal. No. Oh, when you lose <laughs> signal, you won't see anything. Oh. And then this is video button if you want to record, and this is take photos. Whichever one. This one. What are take these, photos. What are the wheels do? Uh, that's your camera angle. I think your left one's up and down. I can't remember unless it's in my. My uh, ABS oh, yeah. traction control went off. Nice. Holy crap. But yeah, one's your camera. And one is your aperture. Aperture? Yeah. I don't know if it's going too well. It's not bad. That means it could be better. <laughs> <laughs> That's too cool. <laughs> I gotta hand it back before I, I crash it. I think it's recording. <laughs> oh, Hopefully it was recording. Stand right underneath of it. Take your hat off. I don't know if I want to do that. <laughs> oh my god. That's a lot of downforce. Yeah. That's insane. Tree trail. Take a look at it. Sure, we'll try it. You Should I ride with you? Yeah, you want to ride with yeah, me yeah. first? Yeah, yeah. Ben, there's three paddles. It's so weird to see somebody else drive the Jeep. I know. Is that all yours back here too? Yep. Is that your excavator? No. I was like, shit, let me drive that thing next. I, <laughs> I think the last time I rode in a YJ was when I was in Florida. Ooh. Watch that rock. See that 
tree kicks out on the bottom of it. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, that is I'm tight. I'm so much wider than everybody else. And see, I cut out up there. I want to, like this stuff here. Yeah, much better disconnected. Yeah. Yeah. Just a little tiny trail. Yeah. So this, we call this the bell ringer. The bell ringer. Okay, so we used to hit that pole. But now that I'm all painted up, I don't know if I'll do it. <laughs> First gear, four low, no gas, no brake. And this little YJ can do it. The little tractor. <laughs> yeah. You hear freak people out? I'll ring it for you. <laughs> <laughs> That's too funny. That's ringing the bell. Right in front of semi truck too. <laughs> oh yeah, see you're fine. Yeah. Bullet liner. The bullet liner, dude. <laughs> oh, he's got it too, no problem. He's got a little bit of gas in there though. I don't think he would make it. Yeah! Because <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you have the turns and stuff. It almost sounds like a V8, right? <laughs> Not from the inside. No. So the one thing that I do like about it is green. No. Uh, <laughs> well, the reverse button. Kinda. The Volkswagen reverse button. Yeah. So oh, the trigger. Yeah. I was just kind of worried that I was gonna throw it up into a reverse or third, but if you don't pull up, you can't throw it in reverse. Yeah. Oh, also, I feared his tires. So he yeah, can't. I just saw that on the. Oh yeah. So on the concrete. <laughs> you probably should go through and get a little bit more mud. Then you can fling it because it's a lot of fun. I yeah. Get that video when you come it, out onto the concrete yeah. and clean everything out. <laughs> I, I just, I was like, you know what? I'm gonna do it. So That's fine. You gotta hit it. No, it's not slipping. Stay out of his way. It's actually really funny because I don't have any hands on the steering wheel yes. or foot on like the gas or brake. And they say Tesla's the, it. <laughs> Tesla's the only self-driving car, right? <laughs> right? Actually, we should ghost ride it, send it through by itself. Yeah. Oh, it's going left, or right. It should be all right. I'm gonna laugh so hard when she just stops. She's probably gonna come to me, I'm gonna have to move. I may have to move. Oh, that is sloppy. <laughs> it's, going it's going right for you, man. <laughs> yep, she wants me. We'll move. She, oh, she's coming straight at this. Man, she's chasing me. Yeah, that's hilarious. Uh oh. No, she'll be all right. She's still moving. Uh oh. She's stuck now. Uh oh. Yeah, you should have. Somebody's gonna. I'll go get my Jeep. No, get in. Uh, get in from the passenger side. You're good. Oh yeah. <laughs> That's funny.
what's the matter, Ben? What's the matter? Rock it a little. There you go, there you go. All right, now go forward. Give her help. Rock it now in four. In four high. Rock it. There you go. Oh, clutch is hot. Hey, keep going in reverse next time. Rock her all the way in reverse. Keep going as far as you can. <laughs> the windshield. Yeah, my clutch is gone. Damn. That covers up the green nicely, though. I was thinking about doing like a splatter paint job, so. It blends well. Yeah. <laughs> Funk sweaty is just right. Look at this. That's like some sticky mud you got. It's like. <laughs> It's just wet in there. This is the mud pit we were just stuck in. I went straight through here, no problem, four low first gear. It just went completely through. So then we decided it was a great idea to send it through by itself. So we ghost rid, rid ghost rid, ghost road, ghost ride, ghost road the Jeep through it. We sent it in by itself. It started turning and then it got stuck down over here, which is, this is like the real sticky stuff. You could see I couldn't even get any traction here. I mean, this stuff is just like, it's just thick. And I think this is one of the deepest parts here. So when it started going off course and ended up over here, it got stopped. I had to crawl in through the passenger side and then try and wheel it back and forth and rock it all the way back out. We ended up obviously getting it back out, but that's the aftermath of what happened. There you go. Oh, you're so close. <laughs> you having it more? Yeah. yeah. Check it out, my bad. Hey. <laughs> now everybody's getting stuck. Yeah, go Liam. Oh, he's got it, no problem. How many more years till his license? Six and a half, seven. <laughs> yeah, he just rode right through it, shit. Not bad, better than and, it, and it's a manual, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. GoPro a little dirty, handle. Nothing on the windshield, I don't think, but most of it just hit my dash, my seat, my seat there. That handle, so it wasn't it wasn't too awful. Well, I guess I got it on the steering wheel. And it would have yeah. never. And you've got it on the inside of the window. Oh no, actually, <laughs> I still have this on mine. It would have never yeah. happened if you weren't not inside. If I if I didn't let it ghost ride. <laughs> yeah, if it didn't ghost ride. Can't see anything out of this windshield right now. And we're gonna clear the tire. So, oh, second gear. <laughs> He 
<laughs> yeah, there's a lot of mud on those tires for sure. Funny how half the back rear window is clean. <laughs> Damn. Totally worth it though. I really wish it would have made it all the way through. That would have been awesome too. Yeah. <laughs> Next time. I need to keep it straight. Yeah, a little straighter. I think it hit something as soon as I jumped out. I think it like just started to curve a little bit and then it started coming back. And that's when it hit like the super deep stuff. All right, now back to uh, what we were doing before when I just arrived here. We can take the forklift, don't you think? Honestly, not a bad idea. I'm barely old enough. We have too many safety features on that. I was gonna say before I put the forks back in the back end of Kirsty's Jeep. Yeah, this is up and down, this is your tilt forward and backwards, and this is your side shift. Okay, okay. And then it's kind of touchy. Oh, uh, and they're all pretty much labeled, so I should be able to do that. Oh, hold up, hold up, hold up. <laughs> Making me nervous right <laughs> off the bat. <laughs> I'm learning all sorts of new stuff today. How to drive a drone, how to ghost ride a Jeep through a mud pit and then get it stuck and then try and get it back out, how to drive a forklift, I'm not trying that. I'm gonna hurt my other shoulder doing that. More. More. Keep going. Keep going. More? No. Up. Down, up, good. Good. See, that didn't take too long. This side went way faster. You wanna bring that? Yeah, what, five minutes it only took? To yeah, right? So we've had a pretty successful day here. Got the lift done and uh Ah, now that I'm looking at my Jeep again, this thing's just toasted. But that's the way it should be. I need to figure out, I don't want to use my wipers because I don't want to ruin them. So I might spray that windshield off a little bit just to make it home. But other than that, all caked up in here. This is going to be one hell of a time to power wash this thing, especially underneath here. That's going to be the biggest problem. All right, one last test before we head home. Yep. 27 and a half. 27 and a half? But, see what you'd be parking on. I mean, you can park on a 40. Not bad for a little two and a half inch lift. And like we were saying before, that bump stop's really... Stopping it. That's what's restricting. Oh yeah, yeah. I still got maybe a couple more inches there. All right, we are now on our way back. Look at this mess I have inside the Jeep. <laughs> so we had an absolute blast over there. Uh, it's a little coarse, but it's still like, it had a lot of stuff that obviously I've never done in the JL before. Um, this thing handled really well. Some of the, those really steep climbs. Uh, the mud pit was, ah, I mean, <laughs> It, was, it mostly was just because I was completely caked in between all my tread and it was just, it was having a hard time getting in and out of there. Uh, and then my clutch was just not having it, so I kept stalling. But besides that, I had an absolute blast. Uh, they do have some other little trails that I wasn't able to fit in because my Jeep's just too dang wide uh, and long. So we've been, uh, we actually took the trail. We went in the YJ and then the two-door JK, and it was still a blast. So next time we're definitely gonna have to get Hallie out here. Uh, I wanna get Ryan down here. This was just like a little tiny, like little tiny taste of like what's coming up next month. Uh, we are actually trying to plan next, yeah, next month. Next month we're trying to plan a trip to Roush Creek off-road. So if any of you are in the area, get down there, hit me up in the comments below. I, I will let you guys know the dates as soon as I know and probably gonna go out on like a Friday, camp overnight, wheel all Saturday, and then head back to Columbus on Sunday. It's about a six, seven hour drive for us. So most of our weekend's gonna be sent driving to the destination, but we wanna spend most of Saturday actually wheeling at Roush Creek and earn some trail badges. So if any of you guys wanna meet up with us down there, 
uh, please feel free to, as soon as I know more about the dates and times, uh, stuff like that, I will leave all that information in the link below. Or you guys can hit me up on Instagram, I'll probably know more about it and I'm, I'm better about getting back to people through my Instagram than I am on my YouTube channel. So, you can hit me up, either one of those, if you guys are interested in that. And yeah, so hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. When we get home, we'll take one last lap around the Jeep to show you the damage and then we will call it quits for today. If you enjoyed the video, get down there, hit the thumbs up button. If you haven't already, hit subscribe. There's a lot more off-roading coming up again next month. And uh, yeah, stay tuned. We'll catch you guys in the next one.